what it is, what it do, Cyber World. It is your girl, the one, the only Ash Said It. Ash Said It.com, Ash Said It.com. Welcome to the Ash Said It Daily Podcast Show. I appreciate you guys for all of your love and support. Over 1,400 episodes and half a million streams worldwide. None of this is possible without you guys, so I thank you so, so very much. And I know that we're, you know, we're kind of in a weird place in our country, you know, and we're living this quarantining, social distancing life, but we got to stay in shape. You got to move, all right? So I've got co-founder of The Sweatshop with me here. Hey, Matt. Hey, how's it going, Ash? Thanks so much for having me on. I appreciate it. No problem. Thank you so much for joining us. Now, Matt, what part of the country are you holding down right now? So, yeah, we're, we are uh, located in Illinois, right off of uh, the North Chicago suburbs right here. Okay, cool, cool. What what kind of weather are you guys having? Uh, so, so far for the past, like, two weeks, it's been pretty hot and humid and and sunny, so it's been a nice change of pace. Uh, you know, it's been crazy Chicago weather for the past like seven months, so it's pretty nice out here right now. Hopefully, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to say that because then it, you know, as soon as you say that in Chicago, the weather changes. So it's nice for now, but it'll it'll change soon. Gotcha. Now you started this company with your beautiful wife, so you guys are co-owners, co-founders of this amazing brand. So how did that story start? So, well, the, we own gyms out here in uh, Chicago Land called The Sweatshop, and so it began about 10 years ago, and really, the, this is really different than um, any other gym. The unique thing in kind of what we do and specialize in is making exercise, working out really, really fun mm-hmm. and kind of crazy and insane at the same time. So have you ever seen any, like, pictures or videos or anything that we do, you would instantly be like, what the heck? is going on in this place. Because you'll see, if you see a picture or video from us, it'll be like, you know, uh, pictures of the Kardashian training people or like, uh, you know, guys dressed up as Mario Brothers, you know, exercising and jumping in tunnels. It's just weird, <laughs> crazy stuff. And so the original concept uh, to go back was, what would it be like, the question I had, what would it be like if this uh, specific character or celebrity was your trainer for the day. So what would it be like if, you know, the Brady Bunch family were your trainers? How would they act? And how would, you know, Marsha and Jan and Greg train you? And what would they say? And what music would they play? And so it became this, like, fun, really interactive thing. And people would, like, really come out to see the story and the entertainment factor. And so that's what we really say is don't just work out. Get entered trained as opposed to <laughs> entertained or trained. So it really is um, part exercise, part entertainment part training and so that's really kind of how the origin story began for 10 years and now um moving to online we just started our uh, thing called sweatshop on demand which is sweatshop on demand.com which we offer like the same exact thing we've done in person just online and videos so you can get you know workouts with all your favorite celebrities and characters <laughs> like tiger king and uh you know every, everything you can think of we uh richard simmons and um, Bruno Mars and Justin Timberlake and so how would they interact with you and so that's kind of how it started Wow now before the on demand came into play and you guys were just dealing with the gym what were some of those yeah. challenges that you guys were facing as far as getting the name out yeah and so I think I think the thing about it is when we first especially when we first started is it, we're so different mm-hmm. and that's kind of um, how it began my, mm-hmm. my whole Thing with starting the sweatshop and gym is really about, you know, I love making people laugh and smile and have a good time and entertain. And um, so it's kind of equal parts that and then equal parts fitness. You're also getting, you know, an awesome, incredible kick butt workout at the same time. And mm-hmm. so I guess the, the challenge in the beginning is we were so different and so off the wall <laughs> is that you kind of have to experience it for yourself. And it's not right. It's not for it's not for everyone. People right. who are like, you know, but that's the thing. You have, in terms of the gym industry, you have, you know, cross the people, you have, you know, orange theory people, you have people who go to LA Fitness, and you know, mm-hmm. right? And so there's something for, for everyone. And so our specialty, you know, above anything else is just making exercise, working out really, really crazy and fun. And I think mm-hmm. once you experience it for the first time, you're like, oh man, I get it. And so you're, you know, just like watching a movie, or like participating in a TV show, you're doing that interactively at the same time. 
Yes. And you guys were handling the gym thing for a while. So how was that transition for you guys from going to gym to now we're in this climate of social distancing and you're yeah. jumping into the on-demand, the YouTube videos? Yeah. So the, uh, the whole thing, So I mean, the uh, we had on-demand before. Just luckily, we had on-demand out before mm. this whole, uh, you know, COVID and quarantine thing happened. And mm. so we kind of transitioned all of our our members to, you know, working out on demand. And so it's been, with all the, you know, craziness going on in the world and everything that people are having to deal with now, I think the biggest thing we're we're facing is motivation. Mm -hmm. I mean, everything is just up in the air. People are out of jobs. People are out of work. The schedule, the timing, your foundation, everyone is kind of struggling in their own different ways. And so that's, we're trying to find every avenue we possibly can to keep people engaged and motivated. And by no means is that an easy task. It's very, very <laughs> difficult for everyone yeah. right now. So, you know, everyone is just doing the best they can. And that's where kind of we come into play. So it's not just about like, you know, you know, kicking your butt into the ground with like, you know, workouts. Because, you know, most people right now don't have that kind of motivation to just, mm-hmm. you know, sit at home or, you know, and get their butt beat down. So it's really mm-hmm. about like, okay, we got to find different ways to motivate and engage people, and especially kids as well, too. So that's yeah. kind of our, our goal. What would you say, Matt, has been your proudest moment yet with the company? Uh, did you say proudest moment? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I um, think the, um, the, the proudest moment, I, I can't, you know, like, it's not one specific moment, but I mm-hmm. think, like, you know, the, we've changed and kind of grown so much over the past, and years and you know mm-hmm. built different locations and moved around and met and helped thousands and thousands of people I think it's just like and we, we also go around and do lots of school assemblies and help kids with healthy eating and learning and staying active and all that good stuff but I think it's just kind of an overall encompassing picture and kind of where we started from and mm-hmm. this kind of started like outdoors in a park in a field which is kind of where we're back to right now 10 years later <laughs> ironically but um so we started out in a park, and then uh, 10 years later, we've, you know, grown and built, you know, different gyms and locations, and, you know, now we're on YouTube and on demand. So it's kind of just the overall encompassing picture of, you know, how many people we've kind of engaged and, you know, tried to help over the course of the past 10 years and seeing all the smiles and faces and, and life's changed and incredible transformation. So it's kind of like this, you know, over-encompassing thing that I'm most proud of. Yeah. Now, last but certainly not least... What advice could you offer to any young person out there that might be discouraged about our current climate, the stuff that we're dealing with, and they they wanted to start a business, they wanted to open up this brand new idea, but they're feeling discouraged? Yeah, I think, you know, the the climate and the, the way of the world right now is so is so different. I mean the the way we exercise and work out in fitness and just the fitness industry in general is completely different than it was three months ago and so I think you know right now the industry uh, the businesses regardless if you're a health and fitness professional or you're a restaurant owner or you're uh, whatever you own in terms of a small business it's about being able to adapt and change and Mm -hmm. completely you know grow and if you think you're going to go back to the way you know you were at any point you're going to be out of business real soon so I think anyone looking to kind of start something this is You know, I know it's a scary time, but it's also like a great time because the world has completely shifted. So it's really about finding right now what people are struggling with and what they're missing and trying to fill that void in their lives by, you know, putting out your product or your service or your business. And so that's kind of where every business is at, is trying to adapt as best we can in this current environment. So that's kind of uh, my place. Absolutely. Matt, thank you so much for joining us today. We appreciate you so much. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah. Thank you so much for having me. Not a problem. And let everybody know, of course, where they can follow you guys and in case they're in the Chicago area or maybe passing through and they want to hit up the gym. Yeah. So the, the first and easiest place is just to go on YouTube, type in Sweatshop On Demand, and you will find us instantly right there. Um, you can find, you know, hundreds of videos. Also, if you type in Sweatshop On Demand, Dot com. It'll take you right to our website with hundreds and hundreds of workout videos for adults and kids. Um, and then if you're in the Chicagoland area, we have two gyms. There's a one in Palatine and one in Liberty 
Illinois. So you can look us up that way as well. And we can't wait to uh, see you there. All right. Sounds like a plan. Matt, much more success to you and your team, 2020 and beyond. You know, keep pushing forward. Good energy. Good, good stuff. <laughs> Thank you, and I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Thank you so much for your love and support. Keeping in mind, anyone to tell you that you can't do what you want to do, you look them square in the face, you tell them, don't believe me. Just watch. Watch what I do. Watch me make it happen. Watch me make history. That's what we're doing this for, the history books. Social media is nice, but real life, so much better.